Pop There is an adult animated series created by Ryan Quincy that originally aired on IFC and ran from February 22nd, 2013 to April 19th of that same year. Now, if you have not heard of the show, I am not surprised, as I was in the same boat until about a year ago. A year ago, me and my family had gotten into streaming services, because before then, we never really had a use for them. The first one we decided to get was Hulu. When we got it, I logged onto it on my computer, made my own profile, and started adding shows to my stuff. After a while of doing this, I went to the adult animation section, and I saw a show that I'd never heard of before, called Mad Tale. I noticed that this show had a total of 10 episodes, and it looked interesting to me. So I watched them all one day. Now, you're probably thinking to yourself, what is so great about this show? And that's just it. Nothing. Nothing from the show stands out. Well, besides this art style, which, if you couldn't tell, all the characters are supposed to be anthropomorphic bears. It's a very humble show on how it's just about growing up. Now, I think that's enough rambling. Now, let me tell you what the show is actually about. Up There focuses on Chad Stevens and his ordinary life with his parents, younger brother Jay, and his best friend Chris Novak, in which they just go about their ordinary lives in a town called Pulford. That's it. That's all the show is about. Chad is a social outcast in his school. In the pilot, Chad meets his fellow social outcast, Chris. Now, Chris is easily the most compelling character of the show, and my personal favorite. As he has many problems in his life, and he just wants to leave. First of all, he hates the town that he's growing up in. And he feels that it's just holding him back. Also, his mom, Joni, has started dating this loner stonehead called Terry. Who Chris does not get along with in the slightest. And he simply just wants to leave. And that's about it. I can recommend this show, because it's a nice show to watch if you want to take a break from other adult animated cartoons of this era, like American Dad, Modern Simpsons, and Modern Family Guy. I enjoyed this show because it's just about nothing, sort of like Seinfeld. I didn't like it as much as I would have liked to, but I don't know, maybe I'll watch it again someday, like even more.